Yo, good morning. What's up, man? Welcome to another episode of Morning Coffee Motivation, man. Right now we in my kitchen. I got my water boiling. And uh, getting my cream out. We gotta use this cream right here. We gotta get this used because it's almost done. Look at my look at my coffee pot. You hear it? You hear it doing this thing? All right, so we ready? So I got my cream. Turn that off. Got the coffee cup. Yo, follow me on Instagram too, man. At Sean G. Follow me on Instagram. I gotta go get some. I gotta go get some. Some better coffee too, man. The coffee I got, I don't really like it, man. I wasn't thinking. I like Cafe Bustelo, man. I like the way that tastes. I got this right here, man. I got the Nescafe, and then I got some Maxwell House, man. But I'm, I'm gonna go get me some Cafe Bustelo today, as a matter of fact, man. All right, so here we go. Got the instant coffee joint. So we get us a little scoop of coffee. Look at that. Put that in there like that. Let's put another little scoop in there. Just a little bit. So that it ain't too weak. Yo, hit, hit, the, hit the like button on this video, man. Subscribe to the channel for your first time in. Welcome. All right, that's good. Put that in there. All right. Do that right there. K cup coffee can never taste this good, man. Could never be this good, man. Yo, if you want to get this scully right here, this is on my website, gonna be publishing.bigcartel.com. Alright, now we need some sugar. Now we need some sugar. What's up? Monday morning. This Monday morning, put a little sugar in there. This Monday morning. What's today's day? Monday. What is it? Like the 13th or 14th or something? Let's taste it. Still need a little bit more. There we go. I could put my spoon in my mouth, stir my coffee, and put it in my sugar because only me and Lil Sean live here. You're not gonna get none. So it's not being dirty. So what's up, man? Here we go. Good morning. We up, we at him. It's Monday morning, I gotta do laundry today. I gotta make some phone calls, I'm gonna work out. Uh, you know, we're gonna stay productive, man. We're gonna stay productive, we're gonna stay moving this thing forward. I got some good things coming up for the new year. You know, things is looking up, things are looking good, I'm feeling better. You know, I look good. Thinking better. Doing all right, man. I'm doing all right, man. Get a little Sean today. A little Sean will be here this afternoon. So, yeah, man. Life is good. I'm chilling hard, man. Weather here in Jersey is going to be nice all week. It's going to be like uh, 50s, 60s all week in December. You know? So, we here. Um, what else? I don't know, man. Ain't really much. What else? I gotta do laundry later. Um, I got some phone calls to make. I got some orders to mail out. Go on my website, gumbypublishing.bigcartel.com. Get you uh, copies of my books. 
All three copies of my books are there, my shirts are there, hats, and uh, support the platform, subscribe to my Patreon channel, Patreon channel was sold, that's $5 a month. If you want to get into some mentorship situation with me, one-on-one -on -one mentorship, you can do that. Reach out to me through my Patreon channel. Or you can email me at the podcast with soul at gmail.com. Stigmatism in my soul at gmail.com. With your phone number, I'll call you back. We can set that up. And uh, we just keep moving, man. You know, the future's bright. The future's bright. Right? Because your perception is what your reality becomes. Or what your reality is. What you perceive. The way you view it. The lens with which you view your life is the way your life will be. If your life is gloomy and dark and dreary, that's because your soul and your perception is viewing it through that kind of lens, you know, uh, making it that. If your life is sunny, happy, and joyous, that's because you perceive it that way. It's through your own perception. Self-perception is so important, man. Self-perception, the way that I, you perceive things, the way that I perceive things, that's what makes or mars your life. That's what shapes your world. That's what shapes your future. That's what shapes your day, your perception of it. How do you perceive that? And we got control over that. Nobody can control that. Even if they tried to give you images and information to contradict what your perception is, you can still use your own discernment to rely on your perception over what somebody else is telling you or showing you, man. Your perception is deep. All right, man. We good to go. I got the coffee. What else I gotta do? I gotta cut that pineapple too over there, man. I got a nice pineapple. Maybe I'll cut that to death. I eat that. All right, everybody, enjoy your day, man. Um, we'll talk to you later, man. Peace.